Hello everybody, Average Gamer here. Welcome to just a quick little video where I want to talk about the Year of the Rooster event. Uh, coming this weekend, starting a little, uh, started yesterday. Uh, it's going to be going all the way to... Hey, I didn't realize my colors matched. Yeah, nice. Um, so the Year of the Rooster event. So basically it's broken down into uh, one, two, three, four sections. Uh, the first section... Or the, we'll say the last section actually is the bushwhacker leaderboard event um, that's the usual you know so no kills and kills most damage dealt and all that stuff your quote-unquote score that they calculate for you it's averaged out and just added and added and added on and at the very end I think it's the top 75 people all get uh, the brass knuckles um, but then I think top 10, here's the other thing too, they don't really say what the rewards are. Uh, it just says what the top 75 people, uh, uh, it says Bushwhacker, uh, Brass Knuckles, Hanging, uh, Cockpit Item will be awarded to all players who place in the top, uh, top 75 of any Bushwhacker leader event. Okay. Um, that's nice. Which I admit, I like it. Um, but it doesn't say what everyone wins. <laughs> uh, it's probably the usual MC for certain places and stuff like that. So I'm going to assume that was just an oversight on their end. Um, since the event isn't live yet. Do I have my... I don't want my... Yeah, let me throw my uh, window capture up instead. There we go. So yeah, so... Uh, it doesn't actually say what the winning person gets other than top 75 people get that so we'll we'll have to see uh it also says rewards so we know there's definitely gonna be more than one reward um we'll we'll find out uh the next part of the event is the usual kills most damage dealt section of an event um in this case it's in a bushwhacker so you get uh, five kills 10 15 25 and 35 in a bushwalker and you get premium time a uh, bunch of cockpit items and uh you get the buccaneer camo for uh for all the variants of the bushwalker then there's also the lance formation thing which they seem to be kind of pushing a lot in the last couple events um basically if you can get 250 in lance formations in total you get 300 mc Theoretically, you could do it in the first day if you did 250 matches and got a, or and not even because you probably get it about four or five times a match. Because as long as someone, is, as long as you're in your lance, and a member of your lance is engaged, basically being shot at or show or, or shooting, um, that lance thing pops up every 15 seconds. So theoretically, you could get a lot of those. In like you could probably finish it maybe in a in a, in a few days. Um, or if need be, if you're not going to be playing that often, um, you get 10 at a minimum a day times 10 days and you get your 300 MC that way. So either way, you'll get it. You'll either get it super fast or just long. I have a feeling everyone's going to have it by the 30th. And then here is the other one. So this is the match score section of the event. The first one is get at least a score of 200 over this the spam from the 26th to the 7th for 10 days and there's 3 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 there's 13 days as long as you don't miss three days basically as long as you get a score of at least 200 you're good to go you get 5 million z bills automatically no big deal now mind you here if you get the highest score on your team six times throughout this time frame you get your 5 million C-bills automatically right then and there. Um, I'm assuming this is the cumulative one, meaning this is the fastest one you can get. Meaning you have six matches, get your six done, boom, you get your 5 million. Then you hop in a, a medium mech or whatever, stay with your, your lance, boom, get that done in a day or so. And then hop in your bushwhacker and go around and just destroy people. Um, overall, not a bad event. Um, I kind of wish there was more accumulative stuff instead of, you know, get at least this much over this, this, this time frame. I kind of wish that they said, okay, so you have from the 26th to the 7th, you get X amount of damage, X amount of score, X amount of kills, X amount of kills, most damage dealt, etc., etc., etc. Um, that I would have preferred. 
Um, though a lot of you guys that watch my videos know um, that's my preferences. My preference preferences are accumulative scores. Um, only because sometimes you may not be able to play for like three or four days. Well, if you miss four days, for example, you might lose out on this event. Um, and I don't mean like the whole event. I mean like you might not be able to complete uh, from what I'm looking at at least half of it. Um, other than that, I mean, yeah, it's it's okay. It's it's not bad. Um, you can get up to 5 million C bills, uh, 300 MC, uh, three days of premium times, and cockpit items. Obviously, this part, if you have a bushwhacker. Here, the I'm going to assume it's going to be like the usual bushwhacker giveaways. So there'll probably be like camo skins uh, and MC and whatever given away over here. But, uh, but yeah. So overall, not uh, not a bad event in in total. Um, I'm a little. Uh, I, I'm. I'm. Not, uh, how can I put this? I like it, but I'm not jumping for joy over the event. Um, it's an acceptable event in my eyes. Something just. I don't know. The last couple of months, it feels like they've been kind of dragging their feet a little bit when it comes to events. Like they haven't really been doing them. Um, it also feels like they've been still suffering from from the Christmas bleh. Um for the month, of, pretty much for the second half of December after Metcon, until about now when the Bushwhacker came out, it seemed like they were kind of being a little uh, lackadaisical, we'll say. But uh, hopefully, 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 things will change. But nonetheless, see you guys next time. And am I the only one that's just noticed this right here? There's like a line here. And like this team hits that and then just like goes all squarely. Interesting. Alright, thanks for watching. See you guys next time. Bye-bye.